Hello Aries, how are you? Oh, welcome to my channel, Star 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 and welcome to your reading. So Aries, this is your reading for the month of June 2021 and this is a general reading. Take what resonates and leave what doesn't. Energies might be vice versa and time is fluid. Okay, also Aries, I would uh, appreciate if you would hit like, share and subscribe and comment down below if you find yourself getting resonated with this reading. Okay, I would also request you to hit that notification bell so that you will be notified whenever I upload the videos. So Aries, uh, uh, what I'm going to do in this reading is I'm going to place a couple of cards over here. They will represent your energy. Then I'm going to place a couple of cards over here. They will represent the energy of the person you are talking about, you are thinking about. Okay, and in between I'm going to place a couple of cards and they will represent the mutual energy between you and your person. Thereafter, uh, we'll pull out some affirmations and we'll see what are the affirmations for you, Aries. Okay, so this is going to be a short reading and let's get started now. So, Aries, what is going on in your life? Aries, what is going on with you? We have star. Too many cards. Let me take this one. Three of swords. Then we have is the hierophant. Okay. For you, we have for your person, we have is nine of pentacles. Then we have is ace of wands, and we have a queen of swords. Mutual energy is that of king of cups and eight of swords. Okay, so Aries, uh, you may be dealing with uh, Aquarius. You may be dealing with a Taurus. You may be dealing with Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Uh, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. So air and earth is standing out very strong you may also be dealing with a scorpio okay so the star then three of swords and hierophant aries okay huh So Aries, I, I see that there is an energy where you have started accepting the situation, where you have started accepting the things the way they are. You are no more fighting with a certain situation. You are no more fighting against the will of the universe. Okay, you are no more fighting uh, for your desires. Earlier, there was a strong energy that you wanted the situation to work out for yourself you wanted the situation to happen for you you wanted your person to come back to you you wanted to reignite the situation with them and you okay but now you are an energy where there is there is a sense of calm okay the chaos in your mind the chaos in your uh, in your heart is no more Okay, earlier there was this restlessness, earlier there was this uh, bit of a desperation, earlier there was this chaotic energy where you were like, no, I want this person back in my life. I, I loved them a lot. I still love them a lot. And I know that they also love me a lot. They haven't accepted it. Okay, but uh, probably they will accept it in future. Uh, I want both of us to come together and there is a very high potential in the situation. I want the situation to work out. So there was a lot of uh, restlessness when it comes to this person or when it came to the situation. And there was a bit of desperation as well where you wanted things to work out. Okay, the way you wanted them to work out. You wanted things to happen the uh, as per your dreams, uh, as per it, 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 to be with this person was your dream, okay. But now you are, you are very much settled, okay. The chaos has gone away from your mind, body, and soul, and slowly and steadily you have started accepting that. I accept that uh, the situation has not worked out. If it is meant to work out, it will work out. If it is meant, if I'm meant to walk away, if I'm meant to find someone else, I'm 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 okay with that. Okay, whatever the future holds for me, I am ready to accept that. Okay, I'm no more going to fight that situation. I'm no more going to. I'm no more going against the will of the universe, or I'm no more going against the will of what is or against what is meant to happen for me. Okay, I'm ready and I'm willing to accept whatever is coming my way. And because of that calmness, I also see that there is a bit of a shift in energy where Aries, you are focusing on yourself, where you are more about uh, trying to go back to the roots. 
okay what you are trying to do is trying to go back to the roots you are somehow sensing that uh, you went off the track especially uh, during the course of this relationship you were not the kind of a person who you are actually when you were with like you know when you were with this past person of yours you felt like you are not who you are you are a bit different okay and that's why uh, now that you are not with this person and now that the storm inside you has calmed down okay you are uh, trying to get back on the track you are making efforts to uh, go back to the roots you are making efforts to find yourself or the find that lost uh, aspect or element within yourself okay i also see aries a uh, a very strong energy where you are developing some strong uh, desires towards your career okay there is a very strong energy or an energy there is an inner voice that is trying to tell you or that is trying to guide you that now is the time that you need to focus on one specific area of yours okay you can uh, give more attention towards that area there is this inside voice that is trying to guide you towards uh, towards a certain direction and that direction is trying to explore your potential okay uh, that direction is leading you to and uh, leading you to a phase where you want to explore more and more potential inside you and you know that you have this fiery energy inside you and you know that that fiery energy has been given to you so that you can achieve certain things uh, within you no not everyone in and around around you has that strong desire or has that strong fire uh, fire inside them the way you have it okay you have a very strong fire inside you and that fire was doused off uh, when you were with this person okay but now you are sensing that that fire inside you is again reigniting and the fire is to fulfill your dreams and and your wishes and yes to be with your person was also one of the dream but there are some other dreams also which probably you wanted to do certain things since your childhood and now you are working in that direction since childhood you always wanted to be someone for some of you you wanted to be you know do something uh, which will give you some name and fame for some of you you wanted to be uh, you know a highly educated person for some of you you wanted to do something which wh wherein you will get a lot of recognition for whatever you're doing okay so uh, i see that you're working in that direction you're working in that direction you're accepted that your heart is broken you have completely accepted that but you are no more uh dwelling on that energy aries that uh, yeah my heart is broken and i am this and i'm that and i don't feel good about it yes there was you have been through that phase and at the same time you have accepted it that you were in that phase now you don't now you are not dwelling in that phase you are getting out of that phase and in fact you are you are heading in a direction which is much more beneficial for you as a person okay you are heading in a direction where you want to grow as a person okay where you want people to respect you where you want people to look up to you where you want people to appreciate you okay uh, appreciate your hard work and recognize your hard work right so you are moving in that direction uh, do you love your person yes you do love your person and that's why there was this major heartbreak right you loved them so much but things didn't happen the way you wanted them to happen and that's why uh, you are so heavily heartbroken right when it comes to your person your person is uh, your person they are feeling very passionate about you aries okay they probably are watching you they are watching you or they are asking people to keep a watch on you and uh, they are watching you grow they are watching you become very independent they are watching you become very self reliant you are no more codependent on anyone for your own happiness for your own financial needs and they are very much appreciating it and you growing as a person or you becoming financially independent and you becoming you rising up okay is such a turn on for them they <laughs> they want that strong passionate between uh, beginning with you and them all over again 
okay but yes there is definitely a fear of you rejecting them or there is definitely a fear on their mind that you don't want them there is definitely a fear uh, for some of them there is a different fear okay there is an energy of fear so one fear is that you don't want them you may not you may reject them you may not entertain them the other fear is that the third party may create a hurdle uh, for them okay so there is this different fear for some of uh, some of uh, for some of your persons that uh, the third party may want to create a hindrance over here okay but nevertheless i see that there is a intention to have a strong beginning but i also see this is a, a bit of sexually driven intention as well okay uh, so we have uh, mutual energies out of king of cups and uh, we have as eight of swords aries uh yeah i mean there there is this there is this love for one another okay but that love is also accompanied with a lot of uncertainty especially now that you have lost a trust in this person it has become difficult for you to uh, uh you know it has become difficult for you to trust them all over again so even if you even if there is lot of love you know that there is going to be this emotional instability that will uh, probably uh, remain uh, in your heart uh, for eternity even if you go back and even if you resurrect this connection okay when it comes to your person uh, looks like they themselves are a bit unsure when it comes to this relationship they they do have lot of love for you aries okay they do have lot of love for you that that is absolutely uh you know that goes without saying uh however i also see that this person is still unsure as to what they want when it comes to you and what they want when it comes to the third party okay so even if a small fight between you and them makes them so insecure and uh brings so much of fear inside their mind that to seek that comfort they go back to the third party they rush back to the third party okay so instability or you know minor frictions between you and them makes them very anxious okay so they they are still not able to uh, what shall i say they want this relationship but then bit of ups and downs they are not able to cope up with those ups and downs look none of the relationships are perfect okay there are going to be fights even if you move on aries there are going to be fights with another person as well no one comes with a very uh, perfect nature neither are you perfect neither am i perfect no one else in this world is perfect okay so ups and downs in a relationship are bound to happen but how to overcome those challenges is something uh you need to develop over a period of time okay the relationship dynamics needs to be uh, very well understood uh, over a period of time and for that sufficient amount of time needs uh, to be devoted for one another and there is there has to be this willingness to work towards the situation if there is no willingness there is nothing happens and probably your person they love you they like you but they don't know how to work in a situation or in a relationship okay so that's that's a problem for them and that that sort of behavior of theirs keep you stuck uh in it keeps you in that stuck energy right so let's see now what are the affirmations if this resonates so please go ahead like share and subscribe okay i don't have extended readings for this one so let's see what are the affirmations for you aries what are the affirmations for you when i am grateful for what i have i can feel good along the way to what i desire beautiful pause the video if you want to it's a beautiful affirmation okay all right i hope this resonates please hit like share and subscribe and comment down below till then bye bye